Hey up, it's Louise. Today I have a box of goodies from YesStyle to uh, film my haul of. I bought these before I went to London and went absolutely ham in Hammer if you've seen my video of stuff that I bought in London. I bought a lot of skincare. You know, I'm working my way up to it, like a 40 step skincare routine, I guess, because I have so much skincare now. <laughs> So I bought myself a couple of little treats, some makeup, some skincare, and some just random bits. So I'll show you what I bought. And you can live vicariously through me as always. Finger guns. So I've never had it from YesStyle before, but they sent you like hella free gifts. I got a tiny little toner sample. It's, it says it's a toning toner, which sort of, of course it is. You know? It's got centel, centel, centella in it. God, I can't speak today which I feel like James Welsh is always talking about and I don't really know what it is. I think it's like very, it's got like antioxidants in it. It's good for your skin. So that's cute. A little sample of a toner. Also got a little sample of a sunscreen. Ooh, you, focus. 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 No, anyway. It's a little sunscreen and SPF 51 and I love a sunscreen. And I've heard that like the Korean sunscreens are really, really good. So I'm looking forward to trying that and uh, could buy a full size at some point. Maybe if it's good. Who knows? And my last little free bear. This bamboo cutlery set in a little fabric roll, which I'm going to stick in my bag for work. So I always have uh, some cutlery to hand. Yeah, I thought it said you were going to get like a random colour bamboo cutlery set. I'm assuming the random colour is this guy. But I didn't realise it'd have a straw in it and it's got like a metal straw and a straw cleaner which is dead hand it because I like to forego straws but sometimes you just need one depending on what drink you've got. So that's really nice. I can be eco-friendly and it's not like it was just a free gift from me over consuming skincare. <laughs> so the first couple of bits I got I bought myself some nice socks because I've had a lot of my socks for a long time and I just need to bin them because they're just full of holes and all like manky and gross. Sorry. Uh, so I've got these ones that are like a grid print on the see-through. Very cute. Very nice. And I'm doing a try on bit of the, uh, the socks because I don't want to put my feet out there. Sorry guys. <laughs> And I got these ones. These are adorable. They're like cow print ones. They're well cute. And these were pretty cheap. They were like a couple of quid each. And I thought they were really nice for my little special socks. And the rest of the stuff I got is skincare and makeup and all that fun stuff. So I got myself a couple of little makeup bits. I got three blushes. I'm really just into blush at the minute. I don't know if you can see how much blush I have on them right now, but there is a lot. It's all over. In real life, I look really sunburnt, but that's the vibe. So I got this one. It's like a really light purpley one. Gorgeous. The most orange blush to ever exist. I really love an orange blush, but I always really struggle to get them because they're always too like correlate and I just want straight up orange like that. And then I'm like so late on the trend. Uh, a yellow blush because I want to look jaundiced I guess but I thought that would be really cool also sorry if you can hear the crows outside fighting they've just been fighting all morning just been having classic crow fights and they've been fighting with the ducks and then the ducks have been fighting with the crows oh it's been non-stop so sorry if you can hear them cawing outside loudly yeah pick these up I think they were thank you crows they were dead cheap and I love blush I'm I'm so blushed today. I love it. Yeah, I thought they were very nice and very reasonably priced. I'm just mad into blush at the minute. It's just my thing. I didn't wear it for years and now I'm like, mm, yes, it is delicious. I love to be flushed and looking a little bit sunburnt and weird. So my last couple of bits are skincare. This is a fancy toner. It is just called like an essence toner. I don't actually know what's in this one. I think it said on the website, it's like a moisture toner, but like mm, I'm getting into doing like a massive skincare regime where it's, I watch too much like of the Welsh twins, right? So 
<laughs> when it's like, oh yeah, so you'll cleanse and then like put on like your next product while your skin's wet and then like refresh it with a toner and then put the next product on while your skin's wet. And I just want to be glowy and to be uh, like, to be honest, I'm quite glowy and dewy. So it's working for me. But anyway, that's me just bigging myself up. So yeah, I'm just mad into toners. I use them a lot, um, like all throughout my routine. In the morning, I have a specific one. In the evening, I have another one. If my skin's feeling particularly problematic, I have specific ones. Love that. So I got another toner as well, uh, a green tea one. It's supposed to be like, it It helps control excessive sebum. So it like sort of mattifies your skin, I guess. And it's a green tea one. And I like green tea. Um, it's gonna be so antioxidantating. My skin's gonna be no oxygenated, but lovely. And I feel like these were dead like cheap as well. They were like, they were like seven to nine pounds for a 200 ml toner, which is really good. And I'm hoping, I've not opened them yet, but like, oh, they're like the thick toners. You know, you get the thick toners where it's not just like really watery. I love those ones because they feel really nice when you press them into your skin, like mm, nice and luxurious. I got a mugwort ampoule. I'm not entirely sure what an ampoule is, but um, I've heard them mentioned. So I just thought like, is it? Ooh, can you see it? Ooh. No, you can't see it. Uh, it seems to be quite thick. So I think it's supposed to be like, maybe like a serum or essence sort of thing, but it's uh, supposed to be brightening and anti-wrinkle. Uh, and now I'm 29. I need to worry about anti-wrinkles. I uh, need to be completely wrinkle free. And on the subject of anti-wrinkles, I got a anti-wrinkle eye cream, which just says wrinkle, wrinkle eye cream. So is it gonna give me wrinkles? I'm assuming it's anti-wrinkle because it is collagen. But yeah, this seemed decent. It seems like quite a big eye cream because I've had them before where they've been about this big. Well, that seems very decent. I used to think eye creams are a scam. I think maybe they still are, I don't know. But now I'm an old hag. I need to be looking after my eyes and uh, need to make sure they're completely smooth. You know? And last bit, a rose, not rose, rice, I can't read. Rice Water Bright Cleansing Oil. I love a cleansing oil just to like take your makeup off and then double cleanse with uh, a different one or the same one, but I don't usually like to like to use the um the oil as the last step because I don't want my face to feel all filmy. But yeah, I'm really loving like Ultra Bland from Lush, but it's kind of spenny. So this was like dead cheap for 150 milliliter. And I also bought one from Hema that's uh, very similar, which was about like two pounds after discount. So I'm be feeling so cleansed and oily. Anyways. All I do is say anyways and do this because I'm always just admiring myself. <laughs> so that is my little haul. God, I have sure been over consuming skincare and treats and makeup recently, haven't I? Sorry if you're really bored of uh, all of my haul videos, but I've just been buying a lot under the guise of birthday. <laughs> anyway, I'll catch you on the next one. Bye, guys.